here in East Cork with Glen O'Driscoll. So I suppose what are we at today then? Sewing uh, Lorette, uh, Malt and Barley for Southern Fuels for four months. Also you're in a Massey 7718. Yes. How's she going for you? Good. Um, no issues, thankfully. Um, yeah, she's 2018. No issues so far. Well able for what she's at. So obviously the reason I'm out with you today is you're using our Trimble system. Um, so you are using quite a pro steering 1060 screen and the NAP 900. Um, so that's all going alright for you anyway. Couldn't do without it to be honest. Um, it's a gift for sewing, it's a gift for you know, mowing, harrow harrowing, spreading dung, everything. It, it can nearly be used for everything and I do use it for everything. Um, best feature of it I'd say is the you can highlight your tram lines and you can set all your tram lines first if you want to. I'm not doing that now in this field but I can if I want to. Yeah. Just takes another job to be thinking about off that is most. Exactly and it's it's it took a bit of getting used to because I wasn't used to GPS systems before but I I could explain to someone now over the phone how to use it. Oh, in fairness. But um, no it 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 earns its keep around here alright and when it comes to night time um, it really earns its keep because you're working late hours and trying to watch a mark on the on the bonnet of the tractor. It, it can get tiring but yeah. when you get uh, when you do sixteen or seventeen hours and and this it's uh, you're fresh enough getting off the seat. Kendrick fitted remote gauge which you're just using there now. Yeah, um, another great addition. I don't have to lean over towards the screen to press the button. It's all, it's all here. Um, this tractor actually came from the factory with a T-bar, but I changed it to a joystick so that I'd have all my buttons here on my on my thumb and the remote gauge, which is here, then which makes it all it's all there for my right hand. And I suppose as well, you have an even nice bit of gear. You're doing a bit of contracting. We do. We have a variety of gear. We're kind of... I'd be a messy man myself, but we have a share of tractors. We have a Diets. We have a couple of Fiat's. We have a nice Fiat uh, 16090. She's a old school brute. Um, she still learns her keep. She does a lot of disc harrowing and grubbing and stuff. So she's earned our keep but yeah no um this year uh, we decided we'd venture towards a uh, bit of contracting um because we'd be slightly quieter in the months of may may june and july we we uh, we have sheep but we'd be we'd be quieter um so we're going baling and wrapping bales and spreading dung and fencing kind of things and digger work and I'm actually going at it with a, a neighbour of mine, Jorin. Um, he's a builder, so we we said we'd join forces and uh, do what we can. So you don't know until you try, and thankfully there's there is a bit of work out there, and we're uh, we're kept busy with farming itself, and kept busy with, with uh, Joe's kept busy with building, but we've plenty of time for more work. Yeah. <laughs> Plenty on anyway, keep you busy. Yeah. And I suppose the, the forge you have as well, I did a video with that with you last year. Yeah, we um, we changed the fertilizer spreader for a GPS spreader and we decided we'd change the sprayer as well. We went from a 21 meter, uh, two and a half thousand liter per tooth to a 4,000 liter, 24 meter, Hardy sprayer with section control and isobus. So we um, the tractor we normally have on the sprayer is a Ford 7A10. Um, so we do a bit of retrofitting to her um, vantage uh, retrofitted uh, isobus, and she has a 1060 screen in her as well, and a Nav 500. So she runs away the sprayer, good, um, and it's a. Uh, it's a good sight to see a, a nice old tractor work on a big blue sprayer. Yeah, I know it, it is. Can, it can be done and she's well able for it. Yeah. I suppose with the life size of us, I suppose 
was the way technology is going. It's very clear it needs to be retrofitted, like you said, to all tractors. Exactly. We, I, we have a re this tractor didn't come with Isobus. Uh, we have it retrofitted just as a backup for the sprayer and the fertilizer spinner, just in case anything happened with the two tractors. Um, better to be safe than sorry. Um, and we have two, we have two triple screens, an F900 and an F500. So we're happy with the last. Is it mostly um, spring barley you'll be setting, or do you do other crops? Uh, we do other crops. We um, we have about 100 acres of Tardis uh, winter barley and 20 acres of, um, I think Al it's pronounced Alwyn, I'm not 100% sure how to pronounce it, uh, winter wheat. Um, after peas and beans, we did a bit of a trial last year with um, dairy gold. A uh, mixture of peas and beans um, worked out not too bad. Um, put it on with maybe a bit more beans in the mixture because the peas kind of um, held them down. Uh, but still yielded well, the 2.3 ton I think to the acre. Um, but you know, we grow Loretta Loret Martin Barley, what we're setting here now at the moment. We grow planet seed for Goral Cup. Geraldine seed for ball crop and we're actually growing some Geraldine for roasting for Middleton Distillery this year and we grow um, Lynx spring beans for dairy gold for feed as well. And, and we grow um, beet as well. Uh, we grew 11 acres of beet last year, we're going up to 21 acres of beet this year because there was reasonable enough uh, demand for beet this year and just the way the rotation worked out um, we'll have 21 acres of bees for the coming year. And just keep your bees in between that and the contacting the sheep and everything. Exactly, yeah, sure. We'll be busy. Um, once we get this week over us now we'll have a lot of uh, barley in the ground and we think there's a bit of rain coming at the weekend but if it's not too much we'll get over it and get going again next week and get the bees stuff in the ground and we'll be, we'll be happy then. Yeah. Oh, that's super. Thanks for your crap. You said anyway, Ben. Yeah, no problem. It was great no to see. Anytime.